A California woman and her boyfriend were found dead in their luxury suite. 22 year old Abby Lutz, a nanny, and John Heathco, who owned a nutritional supplements company, had checked into the $760 a night Hyatt Rancho Pescadero. Mexican authorities say they believe John and Abby were the victims of gas inhalation. In a statement, Abby's family says Abby and her boyfriend thought they had food poisoning and went to the hospital to get treatment. They were feeling much better a few days later. Then they got a devastating phone call telling them the couple had passed away peacefully in their hotel room in their sleep. We've been told it was due to improper venting of the resort and could be carbon monoxide poisoning. American tourists dying of gas inhalation is a persistent problem in Mexico due to improper gas installations and a lack of venting and monitoring devices. In 2018, a family from Des Moines, Amy and Jim Sharp, and their two children were found dead in their vacation rental near Cancun. An inspection revealed that the water heater in the condo was leaking gas. We spoke to Amy Sharp's mother, Beth, and her sister, Renee, today. What went through your mind when you heard about this latest accident? I think, when is it going to stop? Something has got to enlighten the public on traveling there. Kevin Coffey is a travel that risk trainer. He says monoxide. always carry a portable carbon monoxide detector when you travel. It's battery operated 10 years, so you can take it with you. You just have to know when you take it with you, you have to put it in your carry-on bag because it's a lithium battery. Abby's family is remembering her today as an adventurous spirit and a wonderfully kind heart. We are truly heartbroken by this terrible tragedy. The Mexican resort says with no official cause of death, they are refraining from speculating about what happened. But you can get a portable carbon monoxide monitor for anywhere between 25 and 40 bucks online.